just at Nelson Pitt Car Park for the 215k loop. Got loads of snacks. Treating this as like an aid station basically in between. See how we uh see if we're better fueled. Probably about 30k this in total, but hopefully it's a nice 30k, no cramps, no nothing. Range just started right on cue. Right, let's go. Wow. Let's do this. Why are we doing this? Finish <laughs> under four hours. Let's go. It's optimistic. Oh. Thank you. First little summit done. Nice little bit of a spike in the heart rate to get things started. Yeah, I'll just show where the route is. So, we're just gonna run down this route here, down here in the valley, coming across this way, down here, and then all the way up this to the top up there. Great views from up there, you can see all of Manchester. Not the greatest views, but still misty. But what can you expect? March in the UK. Still gotta get these trails done. This isn't even the biggest hill. Up here, around there. See that little building in the middle? Just gone past this one up here, come down this way. Let's go. in halfway just at the downhills now feeling all right to be fair i was in a bit of a cave before some steep up hills to start this line park Gee. stop because otherwise I'm gonna stack it just going down here back up to that little castle up there this way oh my days there's no way around it just through it can't even hold on to this fence it's really electrified Right, I'm going to put this away, otherwise I'm going to be face planted in this. Halfway point, about 14k in. Thought it was 15, but I think we're going to have to have done an extra two at the end, isn't it? Just going to refill the two 500 packs, probably a bit of water, a bit more electrolyte, probably get some protein down us. Right, back the other way. Oh, this, we, we came downhill for a lot of that last bit there. I'm going to start with lots of uphills. About 4k into our second loop. Bit of a slow incline. That we'll probably stomp on. Walk the inclines, conserve our energy. So we don't, so it doesn't bite us later essentially and we get cramp at about 25k in. It's a little bit flat now, Jake's running on, but... Once we get to the top of this hill up here where this house is, probably jog a little bit more. Absolute. On 
put in front of the other. Truly in a bit of a pain cave going up that hill then. But like I always say, what goes up must come down. Half marathon done, 21k down, a little bit of downhill. I feel like all I talk about is uphill, downhill, uphill, downhill. Oh, that's all that's going through your mind, to be fair. Sun's out now. Yeah. Oh. Lovely. This little bit up here, we're going to go around this ridge all the way back down, and then finally back down all the way to the car. Last little stint. Right, at the highest point, again. Going back down now, last little stint. I think we're about 23 kilometers in now. Only about, I think about five or seven to go. I don't think it quite matches up to 30. But yeah, we're going all the way down this way, back around on ourselves, all the way to that little house. And then we've got a little canal there is where the car is and stuff as well. I don't know if you can see, in the mist right in the distance is Manchester City. Probably getting absolutely pelted by rain at the moment, it looks like. I think over there, I don't know if you can see in the distance, you've got Jodrell Bank over there. Cleaning the shoes off. Fucking water's cold, mate. Oh. That's hell over and done with. I think you can see Manchester now. Yeah. There it is. Four hours 30. 28 kilometers in. 28 kilometers. Wasn't quite the 30 we aimed for. The loop itself miscalculated a little bit, it was 14, not 15, so sacked in another 2k now. How are you feeling? Feel decent. Feel decent. Yeah. As decent yeah. as you can do after 28k. I know. Here we are, Lime Park double, two 14ks. No cramp this time, that's a, that's a bonus. Fueled up quite well then, that's a Decent to have an aid station halfway. There we go. Lampart double.